We're joined by head coach Mark Mitchell, Zoe Piero, and Kendraya Williams. We're going to get right questions. Coach, down 15, heading into the fourth quarter, pull out a five-point win. What was the message kind of going into that fourth quarter that helped to spark the team? Well, we say this all the time, you know, still a lot of time left in the game. You know, I, we never, we're never going to quit. Uh, we're never going to stop playing. We're going to play 40 minutes. If we're up 20, we're going to keep playing the way we play hard. Uh, if we're down 20, we're just going to keep playing no matter what the situation is. So uh, that's the culture that we, we're going to have here at, at St. Peter's. Um, regardless of what the score is, you have to play for 40 minutes. How proud are you of the way that the team handled themselves down the stretch, closing out on a 16 0 I didn't, oh, 16, <laughs> I didn't know that. Um, let's give all of the credit to the players. Uh, let's do that. Um, we played absolutely awful uh, for three quarters, and um, they have it within themselves, the, the resolve to come together and play as a team, as a unit, uh, and, and play one possession at a time and try to win each possession at a time. And, and um, I'm just really proud of them. I'm proud of the way Zoe Pirro uh, played on her senior day, uh, getting a double-double for us today. I mean, she was tremendous for us. We really had nothing going all game long uh, with the exception of her. Um, Andrea was playing awful the entire game. Uh, and then uh, when we needed it most, uh, she came through for us. Uh, she's, the, she's the player that I know she can be. So uh, I'm, just real, I'm just real happy for all of the players. Zoe, on your senior day, to come up with 17 points. 10 rebounds, just how do you feel to, to kind of leave it all out on the court today? Um, I'm really happy. Um, I'm even happier that we won, honestly. Um, yeah, I'm just happy right now. <laughs> <laughs> and, and Kendra, your coach, kind of talk about the way that you emerged in the fourth quarter. What was the biggest difference for you in just keeping your mindset where it needed to be in that fourth quarter? Yeah, I knew I wasn't making shots earlier in the game, but I was like, there's a lot of basketball left. Coach James was in my ear saying, you still have to fitness and feet, like you have to still shoot the ball. And that's what I did. Coach, uh, now that this season is over with, uh, regular season, now it's a new season, what do you think you have to do uh, going into the conference tournament to uh, have a showing of potentially with the conference tournament into the NCAA tournament? Well, it's the same thing that's been all season long. Um, if you don't rebound the ball, you're going home. Uh, Kawhi Leonard, you know, board man gets paid. So if you don't rebound, you're going to go home. Uh, so if we can just, I'm not asking us to out rebound anyone, but if we can just compete on the glass, um, I think we can win it all. How nice is it going to be to play down in Atlantic City in the tournament, just in the home state, instead of uh, you know just to change things up this year and, and I guess be a little bit more at home down at Boardwalk Hall. Please. I still feel like it's a long ride. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I still feel like it's the same way. Two hours there, two hours there. I don't know. But I'm excited for a new change. I I am as well. I mean, I mean, I was only here last year in Albany. You know, it was great, great experience and everything. However. Uh, being in AC, being being in our home state, um, uh, I think a lot of our recruits are going to have our, have their eyes on us and their families. So, uh, for for the program's sake, I think this is a is a good look for us. Heading into the tournament, teams have playing some some solid basketball down the stretch. What, what do you need to do to? I guess this is probably piggybacking on Daryl's question, but to continue what's been a, a strong defensive uh, showing over the last. Few years. We, we've improved, <laughs> we've improved defensively as a team, and then you know, but then our offense is 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 kind of gone away from us. So uh, I think we're dangerous if we can get both of those things working uh, simultaneously, and 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 you know, our our best players uh, are going to have to show up and show out uh, in the tournament. And for the whole forty minutes. <laughs>